Watch and shoot. With less than a week away from Christmas, most people are out shopping, decorating, or spending time with their families. Not for these soldiers, airmen, and state guardsmen from the Texas military forces. They're enduring the unpredictable Texas weather to compete in this round of the 2014 Governor's 20 Rifle Competition. We pin the top 20 shooters in the state, and at the rifle, the top eight will get it, and then the top eight pistol, top two sniper, and top two machine gunners. So it equals 20 across the board for the year. Even though the state guard won't compete past the state level, that doesn't stop these guardsmen from participating and giving the Army and Air Guardsmen a lot of friendly competition. Uh, it just, every time you come out here, it just reminds you that you got to train, you got to practice, and uh, come out here and have fun and, you know, see your old friends. The top 20 finalists from this portion of the competition will move on to regional competitions and eventually to nationals. None of this could happen without supportive families. It's a little sacrifice that my family can make, but they made a lot of sacrifices thus far, but I shoot as much as I can. You know, if, if the guard can provide me with a rifle and ammo, I'll probably be there just to shoot. You know, it, it's one of those things that it's one of my passions that I have. The Texas state level of competitions will continue and will include pistol, sniper, and crew served weapons matches. Reporting from Camp Swift, Texas, for the Texas Military Forces Public Affairs Office, I'm Army Sergeant Luke Allen.